Hello, men, women, and a uh, sort of others, and welcome to a new Let's Play. Let's Play State of Decay 2. Yes, finally getting around to this game that was released probably a month or two ago now. I don't remember exactly what it was released, but I've been looking forward to this game since I heard about it. I mean, you know, I'm a fan of the first State of Decay. Thought it laid a pretty solid groundwork for the base building, zombie survival sort of game. It was definitely something new, something interesting, something I was looking forward to, and something I enjoyed, even if it has its shortcomings. And I'm interested to see how State of Decay 2 expands upon the formula. I already know this game has co-op. It's four-player co-op, but it's Xbox Live only, so I'm not going to be playing around with that, not because I don't feel like doing a blind LP with randoms and something I don't understand. And this is blind. This is the first... I know next to nothing about this game. I've only seen like one or two trailers, and I've read that it exists. But yeah, I haven't seen any gameplay of it. I haven't re read anything about it. This I'm going in completely blind for this one. So let's indeed press any button to continue. New community, huh? Manage community. I'm guessing these are fancy words for save files. Okay, do I want to read the... Okay, do I want to read? Okay, this is state of case. You the community of survivors, the link was on my pocket, so you survive from the and will die permanently if things go wrong. I try to wild to get resources you need to survive. Five resources, replenish and building here. Yeah, this is... Yeah, so far... Yeah, it looks like it's pretty much the same as before. Explore every room. Yep. Outposts. Swap supplies. And switch characters. Did you switch characters in an outpost before? Extra benefits that you can review on the base screen. Skills, advanced facilities. Survivors with special skills. Okay. Morale. Leadership. They will earn people accomplish things. Heroes and leaders. Oh, that's cool. You can have leaders, so you can have your badass survivors be leaders and heroes. And legacy. Blood plague. That sounds nice. Achieving a legacy wins the game and unlocks the boon for the playthroughs. All right. Clean the final legacy one wins the game and end your community story. Don't worry, surviving characters are safe for use in the future. That's nice. And when you start a new game, you can bring them around. Okay, so it's kind of like breakdown in that regard. Where you can beat the game and then bring your survivors around to a new fresh start. Uh, and finding new territories if you exhausted resources in your territory. Oh, so yeah, a lot of inspiration for breakdown from what I'm reading. Influence. Enclaves. Oh, you can get into conflict with people now? Ooh, interesting. So, actual player versus player violence. That was something the first set of cake kind of lacked. Station to blood plague. Keep blood plague victims in your infirmary to halt the progress of the disease. If you can bring the cure, you can use it to save their lives. If you can't, you may need to kill them. To Hmm, so it looks like we got more infection about this. Blood plague samples look plains are plague zombies. Plague zombies gather in highly dangerous areas surrounded by plague hearts. You can die by plague zombies. Red's oom gets the blood plague its name. Okay, so it looks like we got a new disease in here. The original story kind of did something with that, but with the black plague and whatnot, but didn't really go too far. Horrible flesh mounds seem to be the focal points for the blood plague. These areas are is explosives or fire. Kill it with fire! Expect to find multiple... They need to be safe, you'll have to hunt down and destroy them all. Each heart makes the other stronger, like they're preparing for you. Prepared for you. Hmm. Multiplayer. Friends can join your game at any time, bringing characters from their communities. Use the radio to volunteer to join other people's games. Oh. So you can, like, join other people's games. Nice. Also invite strangers to join your game in the same menu. So it might be just people jump into the game randomly, so. Hmm. If it's someone else's game, your role is to assist them. You can contribute to the to community facility. You can influence your account for this year. Okay. So yeah, some total time, operations on, roll credits on, multiplayer, friends only. Yeah, I'll keep it on that for now. Uh, 
accessibility. Yeah, this is good. Alright, enough reading. Let's get in. New community. I'm guessing manage again is a save file, so let's just start a new game. Right, three tons again, and you can drive around holding all your car doors open. Oh man. <laughs> just like the freaking pain train. But yeah, even from reading, this looks to have a few new elements. You know, you can fight other survivors now, and they got this new plague you gotta worry about. So yeah. I am looking forward to this already, just from reading, spending five minutes reading the title screen. Beyond that, it looks to be the same state of the case that I know and love, so let's get right into it. Choose your characters. Tutorial scenarios. Okay, so we've got some tutorial scenarios here. Man, Earth Extreme Brother. I mean, you can't. Sure, like a moment taught you. Yeah, okay. So, this is we've got one of them is a mechanic. Buddies. I mean, Virginia Security Guard. Let's go with Let's go with this pair because why not? They have craftsmanship and one guy's a pretty good shot. Of all warning stops at sentry points. Oh, I guess we know what happened at the camp. Keep moving, keep moving. Run away. Hurry up. And failure. What is that shit, man? It's like its whole body is an open wound. Dude, we gotta keep moving. Ooh, that that's one of the plague, uh, plague guys. This place better be worth what it took to get here. Okay, so this is Trust the sprint. Me, Stamina and health. Camps have food and real beds. Access your attack button. Bonk, bonk, bonk. The control. Do we have the finishing move here? Okay. Uh, the button's changed. Shit, fighters got through their security. What security? There's nobody here. Bad damage. Camp with no refugees. Looks like they left all their stuff too. Refugee camp with no refugees. That means they either left or eaten. Hold Y to search, and you can of course fast search. If you know, if you're feeling risky. What do we have in here? Uh, bandage. Source health. So there's a large amount of hype all the time. My ranged weapon is a knife. But I can throw things at people now? Nice. My bumper uses my item. Let's play the drums. Take the bandages take time. Try to use them outside of combat. Okay. So now I an in combat heal. More band aids. I don't want to look at my inventory. Nope, that's not it. Where's the inventory button? Aha! Down on the D-pad. Chef knights. I guess, I guess this is your emergency weapon. Bonk. Ow! Knife! 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 I need to look at the controls here. Uh, remap controls, forward, dodge, crouch, jump, turbo, tilt, combat. 
struggle, fight for your life. Uh, grapple is right trigger. Finisher while grappling. Okay, so you gotta grapple to finish things now. Okay, so there's no feet people into the floor and do the good old bat dreams and destiny. Okay, the right damage pits are having less stamina because half stamina units because we're traveling light. Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, more goodies. More undead. Someone's messing me on Discord. What's this? A bag of snacks. Ooh, consumable. Okay, not more. Right, good and right, the D-pad switches through your stuff. So I can try to repair it if I have spare parts, so I can try to salvage it. Ooh. Dude, you're gonna die if you can't scare up a stronger weapon. I'm sure I'll find a new weapon to replace your bat. I'd love to do that. I wonder if I could throw my knife at people. That'd probably be a very bad idea. Bandits. All bandits. Nope, I cannot throw my knife. Yeah, stab him, Brad. I'm gonna search this box. What's next? Can't kill zombies with these. I'm disappointed. Dude, I'm getting a real bad vibe from this place. This was your idea. Besides, there are too many zombies behind us to turn around now. Dude. You seriously need a better weapon. What do you think I'm looking for? Aha! That'll work. I have obtained tire iron technology. There's a zombie over here. Or not. I don't know. I hear the undead, but I do not see them. What's next? Apparently we're just tripping over shit now. There's an undead. Bonk. Bonk. I wanna grab you. Okay, he grabbed me. I'm gonna use some band-aids. Alright, band-aids successful. Wow. After all this time, these people still hope to find their loved ones. There's a thought. Waiting to make sure your friends aren't dead? I didn't leave you, man. We've been over this. You only came back because you forgot your stash of food. Oh, oh the food I selfishly shared with you? Right. I find. Nope, search the wall. Red Talon. Guessing that's a faction. in this bin. Search all the bins. The rule of state of K. Or band-aids. This whole place is filled with band-aids, snacks, and occasionally a high rider. Right side zombies go down a lot faster now. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Okay, yeah, if you get them on the ground, it's an automatic one-hit kill. Thanks. You don't need to do the special action, so streamline that in a way. Now it literally is just max mash X to win. Unless your stamina runs out. More band-aids. 
All the band-aids. Achievement! Toothpaste pinatas. I've searched ten containers. Hooray! Many more containers to be searched in the future. Civilian services. Open door. What is this place? Uh, central booking? And closed door behind us. Anything. Get off me. Come on. Okay, can I hit you, please? Thank you. Nasty. Looks just like that thing we saw outside the gate. Fuck! Fucking biter bit me. Fuck! So much for food and beds. That's not good. Let's close the door behind us again. I could think this one's unlocked. Another note. Yo, check out these rules. You would have hated it here. Shit, this bite is really itching. You act like you never got bit before. Probably should pay a little more attention to bites. Whoa, yeah, zombie what the hell happened here? Times that's what happened here. What are those red squares? Are they supposed to be buildings? Aha, there is a finishing move. Look. Finish him! I said finish him! Damn, got out of my shoes. Better than getting it in your face. Or no. I feel like I'm burning hot. Alright. Let's see if we can find you some medicine. Is that a... Ooh, a machete. That'll work. Scrap items. I probably want to scrap my bat at some point. That is a shitload of zeds. Just keep quiet. We'll slip past him. Probably should turn off the flashlight. That might help. <laughs> Side of the head. <laughs> Name is Chad. Aquila Sky Pache. That's a screamer. Hey, up here! Get to the ladder! Ooh. Go, dude, move! Hello. Get to the ladder if you want to live. What are you doing here? This camp has been decommissioned. Oh shit. Did you decommission the food too? We haven't eaten in days. Strategic redeployment of resources. The brass pulled the whole op. The army's gone, my friend. Except for the few misguided fools who thought they could still do some good here. Seriously, dude. It's like my fucking blood is on fire. Uh-oh. I've heard that symptom before. My friend got bit by a real nasty zombie with blood all over it. Yeah, normal meds won't help. 
Better head to the s &B. And pray the doc still has what you need. Tell her I sent you. Alright, Ben. Swine and bovine restaurant. I can still slide down ladders. Good. Hello, Dr. Doc. Why are you still here? The last trucks left days ago. He never gives up, does he? Okay, what do you need? My friend got bit. He says his blood is on fire. I see. You better come with me. That thing in the cage looks like the one that bit me. Let me have that thing in a cage. You're looking at blood plague. Once you catch it, you just burn up from the inside. Hold up. I'm gonna turn into one of those things? You would, if I weren't here. You, time to help your friend. Take your flashlight and look for a sample case in there. Bring me whatever you find. Okay. Before I lost my team, we were learning all we could about blood plague. We found a cure that worked if you use it soon after infection. The army took our lab when they left, but they didn't get everything. Do, do, do. Okay, so at least we have a cure. Or things of things. Did you find it? No cure? That's bad. I'll need an infirmary to culture a new dose. Hey, Doc. The camp is compromised. Thanks to all the noise, the Zeds are swarming the east perimeter. That day we talked about, it's here. It's time to go. You know I can't leave Charlie. If you stay, I gotta stay. Then we all die. Charlie's gone. But this guy still needs your help. Okay, Guessing Charlie is man in the cave. I need to say goodbye. You know? Make it quick. We don't have much time. Hey, I need your help with something. That thing in the cage, it was a person once. Charlie and I, we were all we had left. There's only one option now, but I don't have the strength. I know what I must do. Gun. Okay. I will equip that. Sorry. I hope you're in a better place. What do these buttons do? Dude, I'm sorry. I know I'm a fuck up. But please, don't let me go out like that. No way. Someone's gotta come up with all our great plans. That someone apparently is you. Thank you. I hope I never have to repay the favor. Hey, come over here for a minute. Okay, footholds, plateau, or valley. I say plateau. The high ground is the best place, maybe? I don't know. You must take the high ground. It seems we're on the same page. It's time to move. You drive, I'll ride shotgun. Alright. Whee! How the hell do we do this without the army around? It's simple. We stay together. We find somewhere safe. Drive it on the wrong side of the road. This is State of the K2. Yes, I already know how many controls can be remapped, because I already have remapped not remapped, I've looked at controls. So a plague that burns you from the inside out and turns you into an undead. Interesting.
loading screen. And here's the question. Will we get thrust back into the action, or will I have time to end the episode? Because we are about 25 minutes in. Through a take. gas. I guess we better start scavenging. More fuel won't help us now. The way that blood plague is progressing, your friend won't last long without a place to rest. I vote we listen to the doctor. That is generally the best idea. We have to find a place to settle down. Now. For once, the army and I agree. It's time to get off the road and find a home. Some place we can build what we need to keep your friend from dying. All right. Multiplayer settings are now unlocked. Choose your multiplayer settings. Uh, I'll keep it on friends only for now. I think I spotted a possible home site as we came through town. Let's check it out. We're too exposed out here to stay for long. Ooh. Back. Gotta stay away from the sick fucking Z's. Is this the map? Looks a bit smaller than before, but again, you can go to multiple positions, so... I guess it doesn't matter that much. I, can I actually pause with this on? Who knows. I'll just stay offline for now. Maybe I can actually pause. Yeah, I can pause if it's offline. Okay, so we're going to be playing offline. So I can actually pause things when I need to. But anyway, that'll be it for this session. Great start to the game. Uh, some interesting elements. And we'll see how it develops here. Next episode, we might get into some base building and scavenging. More stay of decay things. But we'll see next episode. So, until then, move some later, pick my controller, and have a good time. Peace out, peoples.